Hi viewers, this is Ash and welcome to my blog ash.marinebistv.com. Hey viewers, last Saturday I have informed you all about a very important event emphasizing on water crisis. I'm sure you got that. It is World Water Week in Stockholm. There are a few updates that I want to share with you all. Uh, the opening of the World Water Week in Stockholm took place on August 17, 2009, that is last Monday. And the plenary features top, top experts, ministers and the Stockholm Water Prize laureate who will frame the critical issues relating to water and development and set the scene for the theme of the week that is responding to global changes, accessing water for the common good. Apart from this, there are also prizes and awards. I'll let you know what exactly it is. What kind of prizes and awards are there? The World Water Week in Stockholm is not just a forum for discussion of solution to the world's pressing water and related problems. It is also a place to celebrate the accomplishment of those whose outstanding efforts are already improving the water environment, bringing water and basic sanitation to those in need and increasing our knowledge of water through groundbreaking research. The following award ceremonies will take place during the week that is Stockholm Water Prize, Stockholm Junior Water Prize and Stockholm Industry Water Award. So to know, to get solution on water crisis uh, and to know what are the various steps that uh, we are taking to overcome water crisis and what kind of prizes and awards are there just log on to events.marinebistv.com and get a whole lot of information about World Water Week in Stockholm. on for the further updates it says port of seattle received first vessel at new terminal 30 uh, china shipping container ship cscl jakarta has become the first vessel to call at the port of seattle new terminal 30 where it discharged and loaded containers from the normal north from the terminal north berth on august 8th the port of Seattle invested nearly US dollar 50 million in the 70 acre two birth facility. It's an excellent news. Moving on to the next one. Amy makes another gas discovery at Belmont. Italian energy company INE and Brazilian company Valle have again discovered signs of natural gas at well 3ENI8RGS on block BM. S4 in the Santos Basin offshore, Brazil. The well, also known as Belmont, is in 327.3 meters of water, is being drilled with Diamond Offshore Semi Submissile Ocean Quest. So, that's all I have for you all today. Keep yourself updated. Do to get more information about this uh, updates, you can blog on to news.marinebistv.com and, and to be in touch with me, you can view my blog ash.marinebistv.com. You take care. See you tomorrow. Bye.